hello dear friends welcome again to my channel hope all of you are fine and doing great yes again i'm here after a big gap with a very very important topic and this topic is really very important and it's you can say it's a daily necessary in rmd industry i mean in apparel industry and the concern merchant doesn't have to work and cap section also work at day basis it's really important and this topic is you know uh, cat market to fabric consumption calculation i mean uh, every merchant doesn't have to do the fabric consumption calculation and for that they used to receive the cat market from the cat section and from that cat market how to uh, i mean calculate the fabric consumption that's to the topic that's that is my today's topic so dear friends uh, yeah before starting just uh, shortly i'm briefing uh, the total process i uh, like this said uh, that buyer or customer they used to send their total product product package to the uh, factory and the concern merchandise of that factory used to uh, used to uh, go through details the packages and then send to cat section and cat people what their analysis everything i mean uh, whether there are total product packages are there total spec sheet are there i mean measurement sheet and also with uh, some, some buyers are giving today you know uh, uh, soft pattern if there is soft pattern that's really fine and if even not so soft pattern uh, measurement sheet is there so from that spec sheet or measurement sheet the cat section can from that measurement uh, they can calculate uh, uh, every point uh, you know nowadays uh, latest technologies are available there like winda uh, then garber uh, using that uh, software uh, from the cat section uh, and considering also the um, uh, fabric uh, you know fabric width then fabric shrinkage then uh, uh, size ratio considering all things the cat section uh, or cat cancer can convert the uh, measurement sheet to sub pattern and from that sub pattern the uh, concern cat um, cat person uh, they can convert to it uh, marker i mean they have to arrange all the uh, pattern to uh, a length wise based on width that is uh, you can say marker and then this is this is cat marker actually uh, here pat pattern means actually different parts of the body of the garments and pattern uh, and marker is it is actually and you can say an arrangement of all the pattern uh, Along with, <coughs> along with, I mean, sorry, uh, lengthwise, uh, based on the fabric width, given width. That's uh, I'm going to discuss. That it will be very helpful. Uh, I'm showing one page, and uh, through this page, I'm going to discuss. So that would be very easy to understand. Please be with me. I'm going to share my page. <laughs> Yes, I'm, uh, yes, I have shared my pace. I think you have, uh, you can see my pace. Uh, see this pace, it is the marker. So yeah, before discussing again, just shortly, I'm going to say that's what is pattern, marker and cat. Pattern is actually basically different parts of a garments. And then marker, it is arrangement of all the pattern of pieces over the area, lengthwise based on the fabric width. And you know, cat, cat is actually computer aided design and it's help uh, it's a system actually and this system is helping computerize because it's a computerized system and this is uh, used to make the pattern then grading of pattern then marker and you know digitize manual pattern also it is uh, helping to make and uh, for all this process say we are using uh, there are the latest technology that is garber or winda and uh, it, see this pattern uh, this uh, sorry this is marker and this marker is uh, has been uh, made by the cat section the cat concern and see here all the parts are given this all the parts it is called the pattern if you see here see it is a pattern it is the pattern different part it's the leggings and the bottom part it is a pattern and this pattern actually it is uh, just here the cat section put here lengthwise say it is a fabric width and according to the width the lengthwise it is just uh put here and just keeping in mind that's uh of course there should be a what the maximum efficiency is possible that's uh have to try and concern the car cat section also used to keep in mind that's uh what is the proper utilization of every pattern without any wastes see here a few wastes are there so you have to keep in the mind about the efficiency here it is given cw 85.64 so it is given the sharp information there 
uh, information from which gap gap part is this one and information is given see here length is given cutable width is given and efficiency efficiency is 85.64 percentage so it's a, i mean a, a good efficiency i can say because uh, 80 plus is uh, we can say it's a good efficiency and from this in given information the merchandiser have to uh, do this below calculation see this calculation to make that fabric consumption here total uh, length is given seven years 14.58 inch so make it convert see here fabric length at the inch uh, seven years and uh, seven years and uh, 14.58 inch it means total inch two six seven inch then here how many pieces that that, that, that have to count if you see here See here ratio all the ratio are given 92 size 98 size 104 size here a lots of uh, nine size total here and if i say how many garments here total pieces more but how many garments here see here one one two then three then three then three then three three uh two and two so total here garments number of garments if we add you will get 21 pieces garments so here see garments quantity 21 pieces now cutable width here is given this 68 this is 68 it is cutable width but <clears throat> at the time of calculation the fabric we have to keep in you uh, have to come uh, you have to take finish width of the fabric the finish width is actually it is cutable width and for finishing width you have to add two inch more that is 17 now what is the gsm of the fabric gsm say is 200 gsm and for the calculation we need the 1000 gram we know one uh, kg equal 1000 gram also we required the one inch equal uh, how many meter i mean one one inch equal 39.37 meter and one square inch equal one five five zero square meter that is required actually for converting the calculation or for doing the calculation so now uh, the, uh, the messenger have to keep in mind this row it i only uh, this row yeah it's very important the formula the fabric consumption per piece equal length multiply width multiply gsm divide the square meter say one five five zero then divide by gsm gsm uh sorry uh, not gsm but divide by uh, 1000 1000 mean to make it gram one kg one gram why because you know uh, that is gsm in upper part we are giving gsm is gram per square meter so that's how to convert in kg we have to divide in by uh, 1000 and then the total uh, what the result we, have, <coughs> we we get we have to divide by 21 because there is 21 pieces 21 pieces <clears throat> so see put the value 267 length here we have got 267 then 17 then 200 gsm divide this 15 1550 then divide this by 1000 and the result divide by 21 so if we divide by 21 per see this page one this one per piece conversion is 0 0.115 i mean uh, 115 gram now you know it is the net uh, so so we always we used to make the consumption uh, dozen wise so if i multiply with 12 the consumption is here 1.38 kg it's a girl's leggings uh, that's why uh, consumption is very less here 1.38 kg per dozen it's net consumption but always we used to keep some uh, wastes you know cutting wastes and then other wastes so consider 5 to 6 percent wastes so considering the wastes the final consumption is 1.6 kg so for this product from this marker we are given the merchandise will have to calculate this 1.46 kg and at the time of the costing they have to put this kg and this consumption that's all up to this uh, to the session uh, next i will discuss about uh, it is uh, one thing is that it is for the net knit garments knit garments you have to calculate in kg and it is given it in yards so yards to kg this way we can convert and uh, for the oven also i will uh, discuss in my next session <coughs> shortly uh, that's all my today's session so dear friends please be with me and uh, subscribe my channel and uh, I'll, I'll i'll share more uh, video in the channel all are related maximum related with this rnd industry that's all for today's thanks